So the second type of solid figure we're going to talk about is a pyramid. And a pyramid is different from a prism because a prism had two bases. It had one at the top, one at the bottom. But a pyramid only has one base. And then the other sides are triangles which come together to form a point. So I want you to think about a pyramid um, in Egypt. And I'll show you a picture of that in just a minute, but kind of put that in the back of your mind when you think about pyramids. That's the way I can remember the difference between a prism and a pyramid. So the characteristics of a prism, like I said, it is named by its base and it only has one base. So in this case, this is called a square pyramid because the base is in the shape of a square. And then all the other faces or sides, remember face is side, those are all triangles that come together to form a vertex at the top, to come to a point at the top. So just like um, a prism, a pyramid also has edges where the faces come together or the face and the base come together. It has vertexes. We talked about the one up here, but it also has a vertex here and here and here and here. And then it has edges where all the faces come together as well. All right, let's look at this one. This is, again, a pyramid. And we can immediately tell that it's a pyramid because all the sides form or triangles that come together to form a point at the top. That's our first indication that it's a pyramid. So to figure out what kind of pyramid it is, we can look at the bottom, the base, and see what shape it is. And in this case, it's a triangular shape. And so this makes this a triangular pyramid. And again, it has vertexes where the edges come together. You can think of those as the sharp points. And then remember the faces are all triangles. And then it, the edges are where the faces come together. So let's look at some other types of pyramids. So I, first, I, I want you to get this visual in your head because I think it'll help you remember a pyramid. If you can remember, it's like the pyramids in Egypt. Now these are square pyramids because um, the bottom is the shape of a square, but the faces are all triangles. And then I put the Illuminati here too, so you can um, have that visual in your head as a pyramid. But you can see here, there's all different kinds of pyramids. This would be a pentagonal pyramid because the base of it is a pentagon. This would be, um, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, a septagonal, I think you call it, because it's got seven faces, um, a pyramid. Uh, this would be a rectangular pyramid because it's the shape of a rectangle at the bottom. Um, so you can have lots of different kinds of pyramids, and they are defined by the shape of the base but all the faces are triangles that come together at a point.